Hi guys, this is Angie and we're playing Uncertain again. What happened? And this is where we left off the last time. We uh, our main goal is to get to the city, I think. I don't know which city, how is it called? But uh, oh, I can see a swing. For a long time, I tried to understand the purpose of this mm -hmm. metal construction, but I failed to determine its practical use. Therefore, I conclude that this is an art object. Okay. I wonder if you understand art, like not in the, you know, understanding the message through art, but do you understand the purpose of art? I wonder. Yeah, but anyway, you are moving terribly slow and I and I just remember that you said you are not a very, um, you know, it's convenient that the door is uh, on the in the middle of the road. I need to get inside. But I cannot open the gate here. Do you really need to get inside? You could have just, I don't know, ignored the whole thing. Uh, it shows me which arrow I should um, push. This is pretty nice. And we're done. Are we done? Oh, we're inside. It's it seems bigger. Oh, a fried robot. Can we do a CPR or something? Fellow robot, how are you? This robot is badly damaged due to an accident. It is possible that it piloted this shuttle. I need more information about what occurred here. Ah, uh, find a way to switch on the robot. My touch will not make this robot okay. functional. Okay, if you think so. Let's try getting upstairs. I love how old style is this, the, the controls here. The onboard computer is still Okay, maybe there's a, a black box? Or something. Diagnostic. Life support system not active. Autopilot. Off. C log. Power supply not responding. Engine not responding. Fuel tank leaking. Anyway, locked. Communication not, res not responding. Not responding. None. Landing gear released. Flaps released. Ship is not ready to fly. Eliminate all faults to continue. Okay. S disable alarm because it's annoying. Open hold. Uh, oh, I need a code. Shuttle command. Ship A data is corrupted. Please use manual control. Check hard drive device and try again. Okay. There's nothing more here. And there's nothing more here. I think I need to go down. Maybe I should, you know, go past that robot. Can I? Oh, I can. Okay. What's in here? According to the indicator, there is still some charge in the accumulator. Okay. Can we take it? Oh, you need some power, but you are damaged, so... I need some wires to connect the accumulator. Okay, I think maybe we should go for the wires. Maybe we should go back to the... Or is it a... Oh, there's a door here! Nice! And there are cables! Is there anything else there? A lithium sulfur accumulator mm -hmm. was common for older aircraft models. It applies standard mm -hmm. voltage, but it is not suitable for robots due to the excess weight and dimensions. We use a more efficient portable version. I have already found a working I accumulator. Know. Okay. I thought that there's maybe anything else that we can find there. Now we can power up this, this guy. It is possible that I can power it with the accumulator that I found. Yes, and open. This is like an operation on an open heart. 
but it's an operation on an open uh, hardware. <laughs> Oh my god! One. Okay, one seven. One seven one. Okay. Okay, I got three numbers. The pilot is no longer functioning. What did he say? Who should I help? And what are these numbers? I is think it it's a code? a code for the, for the, you know, uh... Ah, oh, thank you for writing that down. I don't have to. I think it's for the computer here. But what's the fourth number? Open hold. 171... 171... I don't know, 7? Diagnostic. Hmm. Yeah, I think the numbers are for this computer. Oh, there's another door here, but it's closed. Oh, it's probably this. This this cargo hold. It is obvious that this door leads into the hold yep. of the shuttle. The door is locked. My observations indicate that it will not open. Man, from you're here. observant. Uh, dude, can't you help me? The memory chip in this robot may be intact. Later, I can find a way to read the data in order to find out. Could what you happened take here. it now and get the get the number? Okay, maybe I should get back to the computer in uh, in my home. First, I need to figure out what this ship is and why it. Fell. Okay. Okay, I have a chip. I have a chip, and I have a, this plasma something. Uh, but I don't think I can use a chip here. Shuttle commands, open hold. Can I look at it somehow? Ah, uh, okay, I have a chip, but how can I, how can I do anything with it? Is there anything else in here? USS Robotics Boxes. They withstand serious okay. accidents. But uh, is there any computer I can use or something? My touch will not make okay, this... Okay, I understand. Okay, so I have this... Plasma something. I have a chip. A lithium sulfur accumulator. Yes, I have already... And, and I cannot leave. What? Uh, something happened to my... To my... Uh, you know tips over in the left left upper corner okay so I guess I need to do something here autopilot deactivated C log for more info mm -hmm. one seven one zero one seven one one Okay. I think this door. I just had to guess, and I thought that this game would tell me. Oh well, but at least I guessed. Find a way to switch on a robot, but I already switched him on. I think he's permanently damaged now, especially that I stole his. <gasps> How is this possible? Oh shit! Humans! Oh my god! I found humans. They are not dead. Oh my god! That's amazing! 
It's the police. Oh no, they will find me and they will lock me up. They'll send me to be re-educated re because I found people. They look more like humans in, in armor than, than, than robots. The shuttle is surrounded. Step out immediately. Hi. What's going on? I am asking questions here. Identify yourself. Yes. RT217NP. Where are the passengers of the shuttle? They are shuttle? inside. The pilot sustained injuries during the crash and does not function. I tried to reset him, but did not succeed. How did you enter the shuttle? I was charging myself on a docking station when the crash happened. Mm -hmm. I went outside to evaluate the situation and search for remaining spare parts. Yes, yeah, that's pretty true. You discovered humans that had been transferred in this shuttle. You hold classified information, which means that now we have to disintegrate you. No. Wait. What? What? What is this? What? Oh no! Oh no! I, I'm hit! I'm hit! Man down! Oh no. I think after all it didn't matter what I what 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 answers I chose. <laughs> Hello. Uh, press repeatedly. I would not recommend you do oh, that. You sound like a robot. Thank you. I would not recommend you do that. Stay still and do not try to escape, or I will have to disintegrate you. Too? You too. What happened? Why was I rebooted? Your microchip self-rebooted when the EMP grenade detonated. Your system data has been damaged. Automatic recovery took time. You function correctly now. Okay. Those police officers. Why would they want to Wait, destroy they told me? When they Humankind told you. is officially considered extinct. You just found out that is not true. USS Robotics withholds this information from us and releases malicious automatic updates. Every robot who contacted a human has disappeared. But why? We know that USS uses police to search for surviving humans and then transfers them in shuttles to an undisclosed location. However, the police could not locate them all. We managed to find a few and through them we learned about the others. Hmm. I added some changes into my docking station to skip updates. Apparently, I am different from most robots oh. now. We discovered it during the diagnostic testing after the EMP detonation. Mm -hmm. This is the reason you are here. The date of your latest update suggests that your personal data hasn't been changed. We have to make a decision, RT. We cannot let you go because you know too much about our shelter and plans. However, you could help us. All of us are wanted by the police. Each time we leave the shelter, we take a big risk. You, on the other hand, can walk wherever you why? want. Why? But why? What's what's the difference between them and him? I don't understand because they do not they haven't been making updates. He hasn't been making updates. They know about the humans and he knows about the humans. And I don't know, maybe he's just not on the wanted list, I guess. Well, let's say he wants to help because he wants to learn. I have never met about humans. humans. I saw different things they built. Some of them are unknown to me. These artifacts have initiated a new information cogitative process in me. I want to learn more about humans and I want to exactly. help you. Very good. 
That means you understand humans better than we expected. You will soon realize that you made the right choice. That's nice. I will free you and you may take a look around. When you are ready, I will share available data with you. Okay. Um. At least I was not disintegrated. I would better look around. <laughs> I like that he is an optimist. Also, we have this chip. The, the, the chip of the other robot. I think we could, I don't know, share it with them. Like, say... This room was the first place where my freedom was severely limited. Such situations should be avoided. Okay. Why would humans make so many interior doors? Mm -hmm. The atmosphere and air pressure is equal on both sides. That's interesting. Can you open the door? I don't think you can. Yeah, they are locked. It is now locked. you know why people made so many doors. So they can be locked. An electric fuse. It is too big to be useful. Take it. You never know. I cannot use this fuse. But anymore. you will. Either way, you could have... Take it right now. Hi. Welcome. Hmm. Hi. Hello. I am RT217NP. My original purpose is That's unknown. That's so sad. I am repair bot RB051 Patrick. Your name is Patrick. Gregory said that you would join us. Can you help me out, RT? Of course. If it is within my powers. Mm -hmm. I need to replace the contactors in this electrical panel. Can you bring me some spares? I saw them in the utility room. It is the one with a broken door. There is no lighting there yet. In case night vision is not applicable in your model, there is a flashlight in the hallway. Mm -hmm. Okay. I will try to help you. Tell me about Gregory. I assume he is your leader? He used to be a surgeon who repaired humans. Oh. He worked in the same clinic as Nurse Abigail. It is understandable that they were the first to protect humans as soon as they found out the truth. Helping humans is their purpose. I am Are they humans? Wrong, but after I talked with Gregory, no. I thought that there was more to it than just following the helping humans idea. Oh. Well spotted. I thought about that too. However, robots have no feelings, <laughs> so it is possible that his emotion imitator is more authentic because he interacts with humans. He and Abigail started recruiting robots recently. The USS realized an update as soon as they found out. It made it practically impossible to recruit anyone. That is why we can only count on old-fashioned and damaged robots, the ones who did not receive the update. Our main task is to equip the HQ. Mm -hmm. After that, we will search for surviving humans and supplies. I think Gregory will tell you more soon. For now, we need to restore the power supply and communication. Okay. Thank you for the info. I will go search for the contactors. Thank you. Huh. That's interesting. I mean... Oh, is that Abigail? I thought they were humans. The purpose of the item is unknown. It is most likely a medical device. Nice. A medical tablet. Oh my god. Any patient, uh, Spooner, has been admitted today. He has a major arm trauma and multiple burns, but all non fatal. According to Spooner, his home robot forced him out of the house and prevented him from saving his wife and daughter. Unfortunately, they didn't survive because the house collapsed on top of them. Spooner is in shock. I passed him on to the psychiatrist. That's interesting. So it seems... There's another fuse, so I guess I'll be collecting them. These cabinets contain provision. It is not expired yet. Okay, so uh, the guy's here. The robot is missing his legs. His left arm is obviously from a police robot and his right arm probably belonged mm -hmm. to a construction robot. 
How did he get so damaged? Probably in an explosion. Hi. Hello. I am busy at the moment, but let us talk later. Okay. I guess I need to start the communication and, you know, uh, restore the power before I can talk to everybody. Oh, I think it's Gregory. A holographic table. Inoperable. I suspect that is due to a power failure. I... I wonder... Because I just found... This is a picture. Thank you. Because this robot's name is Gregory and I found a walking stick with a with a flames painted on it. So I'm wondering what's his last name. Maybe it's house. I have not fully explored this place. Okay, yet. so let's go exploring. Oh, the broken door. It's over here. Go. I need to find a flashlight. Oh my god. You, you mean you don't have the, the, the... What is it called? A compact analog for the intercom. The unit is not functioning. The... the, the you know... The ability to see in dim light. A wheelchair. I will only use it if my servo motors fail. Okay. So where's the... Ah, I think here it is. Here's the flashlight. Okay. Okay, we can go to the room with the broken door. There's something else here. I cannot determine the logic of these symbols. It may be a code, but I need a key to calculate its algorithm. <laughs> to find some contactors Yes, here. you do. So let's go. Uh, is it this? I found one electric contactor. I should look for more in case it is not okay. enough. Uh, there's another one. Second contactor. The task would be easier if I had infrared vision or an item scanner. Yes, that's true. There, what's this? An oxygen cylinder. It is okay. empty. Uh, there's... Magnesium sulfate. It is useless okay. to me. Okay. Um, I think it would be more useful if I could move. A toolkit. I could bring it along, but I do not think I will be back to the workshop anytime soon. Hmm. Yeah. Third contactor. It appears intact. Okay. Is that all? Is that all I need? Um, mm -hmm. A powder extinguisher. <laughs> it expired six years, eight months, and twelve days ago. Okay, okay, can I... Ah, oh, this could be useful. A screwdriver. I do not need it right now. Oh my now. god. Oh, there's another one. Okay, I need. I see it. Fourth contactor. I think this will be enough. I will give these fuses to Patrick. There's so many useful things there! Can I take everything? I guess he doesn't have a pocket, so it's hard to... He should have a pocket like, Did you like find Guy the Brush contactors? from Monkey yes. Island. Yes, this is all I could find. Good, now I can finish my work. Thank you. What else can I do while I am here? Nothing for now. Thank you once again. No problem. I am glad to be a... Aww. RT, Nip needs your help. Please speak with him. Good. I... How do you know my name? But... But, 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 but... Can we go down? I have not fully... Uh, okay. So let's go talk to... I guess Nick is the one on the wheelchair. So let's talk to him. Hey! Thank you for coming, RT. It is good that you joined our organization. Mm -hmm. Gregory told me that we have all been deliberately misinformed about what happened to the humans. Although USS Robotics have never approved of humans, 
I always felt curious about them. I read their books and explored their items that I found. Mm -hmm. The corporation failed to stop me only because I blocked automatic updates. Mm -hmm. You are right. Most robots downloaded the malicious update and are now indifferent to humans. Okay. In fact, they alarm the police at the detection of any human or robot who has been in contact with a but human. But how do they know? The fact that the police arrived so quickly at the crash site is unusual. I hope we can figure out what happened. At first, I assumed that it was you who led them to the crash, but then I discovered that you did not send an alert to the police. This must mean that you have not been contaminated by the update, and I do not have to interfere with your intellectual block. Mm -hmm. Then again, Gregory will fill in the details. I just wanted to ask for some help. Can I give you the chip? We are restoring the building's main systems. I fixed the intercom, so now we have the internet. Mm -hmm. The only way anyone can detect us is if we let them. RT, the servers are on the basement level. Could you please start servers number 1, 3, and 4? Then make sure all the nodes are functioning and activate the connection to the internet. After that, please return here. Okay. Okay. I will do what I can. Yes. So I guess now, so I guess now we can go down, but he moves so slow. Oh, is that, is this a docking station? Oh, I can't, I can't see it. Can't check it out. I mean, it is a fuse, but it is broken and will not okay, work. Okay, there are so many fuses. I think it's possible that it would be pretty, uh, pretty. What, Tom? Thanks for yesterday evening. The exhibition was amazing. The white rabbits were adorable. Call me this weekend, Trisha. And this piece of paper is still sticking there. Fascinating. The router should distribute traffic across the network of the entire mm -hmm. building, but I cannot start it. I need to find the missing chip that is functional. The chips I have seen are out of order. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. What's this? It is missing a Of fuse. course. <laughs> It is missing a switch. I need to find it, otherwise I cannot finish setting the server. It is probably somewhere nearby. No, guys, I think I think we will uh, take a break for now. We'll fix the server later. Thanks for watching, and I'm I'm shocked. I I didn't I didn't think we would find humans so soon, even though we found dead ones. But <laughs> I hope we'll find some more a bit more alive next time so again thanks guys for watching and i hope i'll see you next time bye